Hey everyone, welcome to the Grey Matters blog. I'm Sharon and we are playing what I think is going to be the final stint of Mass Effect 1. This may go a little long today. I may crash the car. Okay. I remember when we actually got this game, uh, first time, I think we got the trilogy when it came out on, um, PS3. Uh, Wes was like, uh, I don't know, I, yo, know, I'm saving. <laughs> I, I'm not sure I want to play the lesser graphics of one, and he started on three, and that missed a lot of stuff also back on the original version it was impossible to get all the best stuff if you didn't play for the first two i started at the beginning and admittedly the game still has janky moments just because of some of the mechanics weren't as good as the later ones but die I don't have time to kill you. I gotta go save the Citadel. But, um... The... Yeah, I, I played through the first one. Got to play the second one, which is by far the best one in the series. That's terrible. Hey! Obligatory poly armory joke. Thank you. I'm doing pretty good. I can't drive, but I'm doing pretty good. And that's nothing new. Yeah, I'm actually kind of excited, like I said, this should be the last stint of this game. And don't get me wrong, one is a great game, it has a lot of good stuff in it, but two is just better. Flat out. I was planning on it. Um, I was going to play through the trilogy since I, you know, got it. Cool. Have you played the second one less terrible? Or, I can't remember if you said, have you actually played the Mass Effect trilogy? It's like I said, the second one hey, is the best one. It's incredible. We don't have time to admire the view. We have to get through then that. why view. did we you stop? I was gonna keep going. It. Yeah, right. Okay, we're going to a cutscene. Cool. They... Ew. I have to admit, the Reaper design is really cool. I like giant killer cybernetic space squids. And I love space battles. You don't think you played them all, but you bought at least some on Steam. I have to take a look. They're a great series. Systems not responding. Abandon the Citadel. Evacuate the Council. Citadel Control. Citadel Control. Do you copy? <laughs> nice cut. And back to me. Well, this seems boring now. I didn't even get the cool music. Okay, that I have to admit that cut isn't great. Wee! No, they're not. It's fine. It's fine. These guests can just chill here. So I'm gonna go through the portal, and I wonder what the geth are gonna do. I get to travel space in a car. A really fancy car. But a car. And then, of course, poor Joker has to figure out that we're not there anymore. And come pick us up. All gas, no brakes. I don't need brakes. And where we're going, we don't need roads. That's how you make an entrance. Okay. There are 
reasons this game is awesome. Like I said, it's not as awesome as the second one, but very few things are. Okay. Bam. Bam. These are tough pets. Even the Husker have... Oh, great. Now I gotta ride in a really long elevator. It's gonna be telling me the news while I'm going up there, and there's gonna be, like, elevator music while I'm trying to save the world. Oh, wait. I can still turn. I mean, I look horrible. And back to this guy. Dude, that was uncalled for! Yes, witchcraft. I can move in an elevator. It's obscene! The Citadel's closing! They're sealing the station! That ship looks like it has a fish mouth on don't it. Don't let the enemy ships inside the arms! But you don't have a lot of choice. This is a cool battle scene. And that's just badass. No hugs for our enemies, indeed. Stay out of the arms! I think they show the outside of this once, but if they don't, I know I picture in my head now the Citadel looks like a giant space tampon. Not that you needed that in your head. Okay. Ew, he moves like a spider. I like spiders even. Even when they fall on my head. You were going for a space dildo? No, it narrows at the end. It, it doesn't have any flare out. <laughs> ah, the conversations we get into. They broke my elevator. Sirens locked the elevator. Suit up. We're going outside. Yeah. <laughs> because sometimes the answer is just shoot it. And this is a cool section. And now we'll run sideways down the elevator. Really? We could have just done this before. I think it would have been quicker. That looks horrible. Alright. Elevator broken. Safe to begin moving. Hey. Hey, stop that. It's impolite to tap. And you. And you. Yay! I was playing uh, Doom the other night, and you know me, I am a um erratic shot at best but Wes made a joke about me or was about to make a joke about me needing to aim and I looked at him gave him a kind of you know mm, howdy frown and then proceeded to shoot three uh, demons directly in the head and kill one shot kill each of them and he said well never mind that like do. It probably says something re Score. <laughs> but really, there's something said about playing Doom on a you know, lower level so you don't have to work too hard for it, but you know, at my skill level you still have to, you know, fight for your right to kill demons. 
but... Hey, that one almost looked good. Oh dear. But you're just sitting there running through, killing demons, and the newer Doom is really good at just leading into the whole we're here to shoot stuff, we're not pretending we're here for anything else. Not that I dislike Doom 3. Doom 3 was actually, I thought, a really good horror game. Yes, you gotta fight. Do, do, for your right. Do, do, to murder. Ah, uh, songs that will outlive the band they're from. Who just passed by me? Garrus, was that you? I told you to stay out of my line of sight! There we go. I think when I play too, I'm gonna modify my character to be a straight up engineer. I always think, oh, I can get the best of both worlds by being a biotic and an engineer, and I never really appreciate it. Okay, I'm going for it, I'm going for it. Get yeah, destroy her. Get yeah, destroy her. Poorly, poorly named. Boot! Turrets! I got turrets! Polly Arbery is back, baby! Mm-hmm. Okay, go, go, go! Kill the ball! interesting this isn't one of them but the games that um, reward you for killing as few people as possible it's like playing Undertale which they have Undertale for PS4 but I tried playing it it just does not work I do have it for computer and next week I'm getting a new computer, so maybe the week after that I'll be able to actually play some of the computer games I have for it. You know, with a computer that has a graphics card. It's really funny. I, I love my dad to death, and he is very smart. And knows a lot about computers kind of thing. He'll He's forgotten more about computers than I'll ever know. But... He, um, he actually, uh, paid for half that, uh, laptop graphics card show off. I know. But he, he paid for half the laptop, and it's still a decent laptop, don't get me wrong. It's, it's a few years old now. I want to say it's like three or four years old, but it's still running really well, and it's just, it wasn't a gaming laptop when we got it, and it's just not going to keep up with any of the newer games, so we're getting the new one, and I am not going to tell my father till later because he's like, well, you know, the game, it, it has like 16 gig of memory. I, I tried to tell him that, that that's great, but regular memory only does so much with, um, with playing games that you have to have a, you know, 
I'm gonna die because I'm busy talking about graphics cards. And it, like I said, it, I feel kind of bad. I'm still using the other laptop. It still works great. It's gonna be doing a lot of, you know, online stuff and, you know, various other things. We can still play games on it. Not all the games, but there's a couple games we have that we bought that we thought we would be able to play and we could not. Which is the advantage of console over, um, any type of home computer. That pretty much if they put out a game for it, if it will run on anything, or if it runs at all, it will, you know, run on the console you have. Woo, we get to go inside now. Saving content again. 2077 probably doesn't run on anything. Although I heard they updated it and then it runs a lot better now. Although I've heard mixed things on how it runs on PlayStation. Or at least on PlayStation 4. On the newer brand consoles I've heard it runs a lot better. Although, isn't that an example of what's wrong with um, the big gaming companies today? Where they're rushing so much to put stuff out that it just doesn't work. I mean, EA got bit by it and they're finally starting to learn. Yeah, that's what I heard, that it didn't run great on consoles and... I don't know... But for 10 bucks on PS4. See that? You know. Have you gotten a chance to play it yet? Or is that in the um, ever-growing pile that I have, which is the to-be-played pile? Because, you know, you buy a game, you mean to play it, but then you go back and end up playing um, one of your old favorites again. And he just jumped. Not how the game ends, but wouldn't it be funny he jumps off and just commits suicide and you I'm done with it and... I mean, considering it... afraid you wouldn't make it in time, Shepard. In time for what? In time for what? The final confrontation. I think we both expected it would end like this. You've lost. You know that. In a few minutes, Sorry, Sorry, a little bit got sidetracked with Detroit Becoming Human, which is an awesome game. I love it. And now Horizon Zero Dawn. I love Horizon Zero Dawn. I haven't played the new one, but I loved the original. I've still got a few tricks up my sleeve. You survived our encounter on Vermeyer, but I've changed since then. Improved. Sovereign has upgraded me. That sounds painful. You let Sovereign implant you? Are you insane? Now well, that's I obvious. I should thank you, Shepard. After Vermeyer, I couldn't stop thinking about what you said. About Sovereign manipulating me. About indoctrination. The doubts began to eat away at me. Sovereign Upgraded boss! Hesitation. I was implanted to strengthen my resolve. And now that sounds like a good thing to I you. I believe in Sovereign completely. I understand that the Reapers need organics. Join us. And Sovereign will find a place for you, too. Dude, I have talked to the last race. I know what happens. Sovereign's controlling you through your implants. Don't you see that? Kind of the by definition, not Shepard. Organic and machine intertwined. A union of flesh and steel. The strengths of both, the weaknesses of neither. I Dude, do you really believe that? Future Shepherd, the evolution of all Possibly. Depends on which a ending I choose. And experience a true rebirth. And this is why I always up my persuasion. Sovereign hasn't won yet. I can stop it from taking control of the station. Step aside and the invasion will never happen. We can't stop it. Not forever. You saw the visions. You saw what happened to the Protheans. The Reapers are too powerful. 
Don't give in. Some part of you must still realize this is wrong. You can fight this. Maybe you're right. Maybe there is still a chance for... for... <laughs> Sounds like he's barfing. Plants. Sovereign is too strong. I'm sorry. It is too late for me. No, don't become the Green Goblin. It's not over yet. You can still redeem yourself. Goodbye, Shepard. Thank you. This happens a lot in this game. I mean, throughout the entire series. Okay, most of them don't slow-mo fall, though. Okay. Activate. Vigil's data file worked. I've got control of all systems. Quick, open the station's arms. Maybe the fleet can take Sovereign down. See if you can open a communications channel. <laughs> the destiny is censured. Main drives offline. Kinetic barriers down forty percent. The council is on board. I repeat, the council is on board. And I'm gonna save these Normandy assholes, the aren't citadel. I? Normandy to the citadel. Please tell me that's you, Commander. Hey, Joker, you made it. Either die a hero or live long enough to become the villain. Well, he did kind of pull a Norman Oswald there and open up the arms. I'm here, Joker. We caught that distress call, Commander. I'm sitting here in the Endura sector with the entire Arcturus fleet. We can save Ooh. the Ascension. Just unlock the relays around the Citadel and we'll send the cavalry in. You'd sacrifice human lives to save the Council? What have they ever done for your kind? This is bigger than humanity. Sovereign's a threat to every organic species in the galaxy. I gotta go That's with Garrus. Mainly because he's Council. hotter than you, Hold Rex. I'm sorry. The arms open up and the human fleet can go after Sovereign. What's the order, Commander? Come in now to save the Ascension, or hold back? Uh, sorry. Garrus is just hotter than you. Opening the relays now, Joker. We need to save the Ascension, no matter what the cost. I hope the Council appreciates this. They will. They won't mean much. Although, actually, you do get a slightly different outcome if you do save them in the next game. White and red suit makes Rex look cuddly. Strawberry shortcake. It, it is a very becoming color on him, I have to say. Hey, there might be some goodwill. Inspirational music! Yeah! That looks impressive. Destiny Ascension, you are all clear. Repeat, you are all clear. The Citadel's opening. All ships move in. Concentrate on Sovereign. Yeah, die bug, space bug thing. I, I do say that the pink Make is sure a good color on him. And... I keep forgetting Krogan's have that little tail! Okay, next game they need to have... They've had every other species. Well, they haven't had a Solarian romance option. That's a good way to make sure he's dead. They need... Uh, well, Solarians are less of a thing. They need a Krogan romance option. It's not a lifetime thing. Yes, it's a stuff. If he wasn't dead, I'd say that looks painful. No, Garrus, Rex, and your little tail. Oh my god, he's getting sucked into the Tron video game. There are sections of this game that are badass.
Pow chicka indeed. Oh come on guys, let's get ready. I look like you look like we just got off a elevator. Ah. Where'd you go, you little froggy? Ah, I love the way they have a move. Yes, he did just become one of those frog things, only worse. Ah. It looks like they're gently nudging him off. Negative. This is our only chance. Take that monster down no matter what the cost. I'm working on taking down this asshole. Space laser death squid. Ooh, space laser death squid or cherry scented death. Space Laver Death Squid. I I think that one's really good. But still Vampiric Beavers. Yeah, Vampiric Beavers for life. I mean, we did have to kind of disband the band. But we'll get together for a reunion tour. I remember this section being longer. There's still a lot of after now stuff. Now, maybe I'll start the second one. Unless there's just 30 minutes for the cutscene. Hit him in the soft, vulnerable underbelly! Joker, go! 30 minutes of Joker shooting. I saw a joke thing once about halfway through 2, it becomes go! a... Joker becomes the main character. The thing is, is I would kind of freaking love that. It would have to be a different game, but it would still be awesome. Oh no. The landscaping. Look at it, it's ruined. It's gonna take months to get it back together. And you know this is the first place they're gonna fix up. All the other stuff gets shot. You know, hospitals are down. Yeah, housing is ruined. They're gonna fix up the council chamber first. I was gonna say for a second, is that Conrad? Hey Anderson. It's over. You're safe now. Where's the commander? Rex is like, I'm not talking to you. Everybody's staring, wondering why Shepard's late for her dramatic entrance. Stubby little tail. I'm okay. I'm okay, my battle toad friend. Guys, I had to take a wicked piss behind that bush. What'd I miss? Well, you know what? Probably during all that explosion and falling that got taken care of at some point. Ambassador? Captain? Commander Shepard? 
Oh, don't say it like we that. We have gathered here to recognize the enormous contributions of the Alliance forces in the war against Sovereign and the Geth. It's hardly a war. lost their lives in the battle to save the Citadel. To save Brave your asses. And courageous soldiers who willingly gave their lives so that we, the Council, might live. There is no greater sacrifice. Waterproof space pants. Yes. For the tragic loss of so many noble men and women. The Council also owes you a great personal debt, Commander. One we can never repay. You saved no, not just you our can't. lives, but the lives of billions from Sovereign and the Reapers. Commander Shepard. You believe me now? Your heroic and selfless actions serve as a symbol of everything humanity and the Alliance stand for. It's very and nice. People are dead because you wouldn't listen to me. We gave their lives to save ours. We can honor their memories through our actions. Humanity has shown it is ready to stand as a defender and protector of the galaxy. You have proved you are worthy to join our ranks and serve beside us on the Citadel Council. Consulate, and all it took was saving your asses. And the Alliance, we thank you for this prestigious honor and humbly accept. We will need a list of potential candidates to fill Humanity's seat on the Council. Given all that has happened, I am sure your recommendation will carry a great deal of weight, Commander. Do you support any particular candidate? Anderson. Klucko Dina. We need someone with the courage to stand up for what he believes in. Someone like Captain Anderson. Him? He must be joking. Anderson prefers to let his fists do the talking. And he Only was right, you, wasn't he? Only with you. Are <laughs> you sure about this, Commander? The captain's a soldier, not a politician. That... That's the point. <laughs> I'm not picking you! <laughs> I'd rather have the captain on the council than any politician I know. I think it's an inspired choice. <laughs> the council would I don't know. I think they should have just said, I'm not picking I'm you. Shut up. As humanity's representative, I'll do everything in my power to help the council rebuild. Sovereign's defeat marks the beginning of a new era for both humanity Thank and Thank for the saving council. our butts. Want to put your biggest freeloader on the council? To be fair, Udina did do some stuff some stuff but mostly he's just Keith Sovereign David, David all day long I agree coming. hundreds of ships maybe thousands and I'm gonna find some way to stop them and just walk away <laughs> dramatic exit Shepard's right humanity is ready to do its part united with the rest of the council we have the strength to overcome any challenge. Yeah. When the Reapers come, we must stand side by side. We must fight against them as one. And together, we will drive them back into dark space. Yeah. Nobody else is cheering. Guys, I'm not supposed to be in space till the second one. I can't breathe. No. And off into the place where the sun 30 minutes of staring moodily into space okay so yeah why not we're, we're gonna um we're gonna go start the second one because I thought I remembered this being a lot longer back to launcher Really, they actually did a very good interface with this. Mass Effect 2! Okay. I wonder... It probably will take like 30 minutes to get through the very intro. But that's cool. Because, like I said, I'm actually really excited to start this one because this is my favorite. I'd have to say, in order, this one's my favorite, two is my favorite, three and Andromeda are tied, and one is my least favorite, but I still love it. 30 minutes of character creation. You know, you really could. Okay. Um. 
um, new game. Import ME1 character. I did purposely name one of my shepherds Lola specifically for the third game. Okay. Yeah, the last one I did was Jane Shepherd, I think. I really don't remember. Uh, casual difficulty, auto level up off, subtitles on. Continue! Name, rank. I didn't mean to press the button. Crap! Oh well. I think most of that stuff's changeable, but we'll, we'll just go with this. This is another game that is just pretty. Different types of pretty. Name, rank, serial number. Shepard did everything right. More than we could have hoped for. Thank Remember you. Shepherd uncovered the truth. And still it's not enough. Hey! We're at war. No one wants to admit it, but humanity is under attack. Everybody is under attack. But they're sending her to fight Geth. Geth. Well, the guests we suck. Know they're not the real threat. The Reapers are still out there. Excuse and me. It's up to us to stop them. The Council will never trust Cerberus. They'll never accept our help, even after everything humanity has accomplished. But Shepard, the I stuff you were doing in the first game. A bloody icon. But she's just one woman. If we lose Shepard, humanity might well follow. Yeah, I'm important. Then see to it that we don't lose her. One month after the devastating Geth attack on the Citadel, the galactic community struggles to rebuild. The Alliance fleet made a tremendous sacrifice to save the Citadel Council and earned humanity a membership in their prestigious group. Now the Council is forced to respond to the evidence that the Reapers said... I can't read aloud that fast. Evidence. <laughs> You know, just another day. Engaging FTL drives. Emission sinks active. Board is green. We are Dr. Chakwas. We're wasting our time. Four days searching up and down this sector, and we haven't found any sign of Geth activity. Yeah, well. Three ships went missing here in the past month. Something happened to them. My money's on slavers. The terminus system is crawling with them. Mm. Picking up something on the long-range scanner. Unidentified vessel. Hmm. Looks like a cruiser. Doesn't match any known signatures. I love changing this. Course. Now on intercept trajectory. Can't be. Stealth systems are engaged. There's no way a Geth ship could possibly. It's not the Geth. Brace for evasive maneuvers. Go, Joker. Money's on slavers? What the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> Multiple hole breaches! Weapons offline! Somebody get that fire out! No! No, that guy! That other guy! Will him! No! Beacon is ready for launch. Will the Alliance get here in time? They'll be here. Help! Hope springs eternal. The Alliance won't abandon us. We just need to hold on. Get everyone onto the escape shuttles. The Joker's still in the cockpit. He won't abandon ship. I'm not leaving either. There's no time to argue. I need you to get the crew onto the evac shuttles. I'll take care of Joker. I'll toss his ass over my shoulder and drag him out of Actually, here. 
go. Now. I am. Lady on Lady Awkward Space to Grope. Awkward being the keyword. Everybody in. Go, go, go. Don't shatter Joker's brittle bones. I will be as delicate as he will allow. No, that lady. Patoo, 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 patoo. Whoa, the Normandy has looked better. And Joker's still flying it. I do have to say that the spacesuits that very nicely fit, um, fit to the contours of the female chest there are... Unless they just... the spaceships mold to you. That is rather eye rolly. Sound of escape capsules launching in a vacuum. This is such a cool shot. And out of my way! Out of my way! Wait, there's something to press here. Thought I saw something. Oh well. Spacewalk. And yes, when you're wearing a regulator, your breath sounds on, really Joker. loud. We have to get out of here. No, I won't abandon the Normandy. I can still save her. Don't throw your the life Normandy's away. Alive. Going down with the ship won't change that. We can rebuild her. We can't rebuild yeah, you. Okay, help me up. They're coming around for another attack! Yeah! Wait, bad guys. No! But they're so cool! Oh, those were chairs you thought they were a flash frozen corpses for a second. Dude, I am doing my best! And you know, poor Joker had to feel, um,. Partially responsible for this because if he had gone, then Shepard wouldn't have been there. Go, Joker, be free. Do, 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 do. My bones, my fragile bones. I, I feel for him. I do. That has to hurt. Like. Clock. Do 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 First time I watched this, I remember I was sitting there going, "What? No! Wait! They're they're gonna come save her? Is Shepard's gonna have to escape from the ship? Oh my God! Is Shepard gonna burn up in reentry? Come on, guys. Liara can't carry this franchise. And... Upgraded Shepard. Like, completely. It's not a clone. But, yeah. It's not all original parts, either. Um, Mass Effect Genesis is an interactive comic that summarizes the events of the Mass Effect 1. No, I don't want to receive the story. We just played through it. We interrupt this video game to bring you footage of the movie. And I'm, Commander of course, Shepard blanking Commander. on the name of it. The one where the guy goes into a spaceship to be in cells and gets trapped in this one guy's body. Steve. What are they ejecting with? I mean, it's good stuff. 
Ew, ew, ew. Yay, I have a heartbeat. This is rather disturbing to watch. Squicky. That is a good word, and I'm going to use it. Loading screen. We're just going with the imported face, even though she looks a little cross-eyed in that particular... I'm going with straight engineer. Um... See, neuroshock, energy drain, dominate. Get shield boots. I'm going with that. Cool. Onward. So yeah, there's gonna be 30 minutes of intro probably. Which is fine. Yeah, we'll be able to get into the whole game here, which it's all sorts of fun. I think she's waking up. I am waking up. And Please, having woken up like this, ready. this sucks. Shepard, don't try to move. Just lie still. Try to stay calm. Heart rate's still climbing. Brain activity is <clears> off <throat> the charts. Steps well, I'm ready. really smart. Stop working. Another dog. Now. Heart rate dropping. No, it's Death just starting to be able to see clearly. I, I can still hear you. Hello? Wake up, Commander. Mmm, five more minutes. Shepard, do you hear me? Get out of that bed now. This facility is under attack. Shepard, your scars aren't healed, but I need you to get moving. This facility is under attack. Now this is horrible. I am going as fast as I can. Oh, what else is new? Yay! Square does reload instead of throw grenades. Welcome back to life. Time to fight for it. You know what? It, at least, it, it's that whole thing of learning you're alive when you wake up. Well, at least you woke up. Sometimes just waking up is a pleasant surprise. Alright. What we got going on here? I'm working on it. Okay. Get through my shield. Nice work, Shepard. Coast is clear. Yay. Achievement unlocked. Woke up. Hey, that is a damn good achievement. I am like not the biggest optimist. I mean, I have my moments, but... Okay, that looks like the way I'm supposed to go. So, video game logic says I go over here. I got a clip! Yay! Okay, I can't carry any more ammo. Ah, no! Fine! I mean, ooh, grenade launcher. Um, oh, L1. Ah, 
Come on. They've seen us. Uh, back to pistol. Don't have to tell me twice. At you are a freaking bossy lady. Hurry, get to the door, run. We'll run through the fire. No thank god she's fading out. She's like super annoying. Really, Miranda's the you know decent person in the end. Oh, that was interesting. Two steps forward. No, smaller steps. Faster. S faster, smaller steps. Our progress is slow, but subject shows signs of recovery. Major organs are again functional, and there are signs of rudimentary neurological activity. In an effort to accelerate the process, we've moved from simple organic reconstruction of the subject to biosynthetic fusion. Initial results Yay. promise. I'm a cyborg! <laughs> This is fine. Update. The cost of this project is astronomical. Over I'm expensive. But nobody seems to care that we've gone over budget. I don't know where the boss gets all his money. Maybe it's better not to know. I just wish he'd kick a little more in my direction once in a while. Oh, come on. I'm sure you make great money. All right. This way. I thought that opened the door. Even the future, some things never change. But that's part of her job. Hi. What are you doing here? Thought you were still a work in progress. I'm sorry. Who are you? Are you with Miranda? Yeah. Sorry. Oh, called her bitch on a anymore. record. I'm Jacob yeah, uh, it was just I'm there in a hallway. Things must be worse than I thought if Miranda's got you running around. I'll fill you in, but we better get you to the shuttle first. Um, why are we being attacked? Security. Usually they fight for us. Somebody must have hacked them. That should be impossible. Unless you've got access. We've got to They're get you like, out of why are they just sitting there talking? Okay, let's get Your out of station, here. Jacob. I'll follow you. First step, let's finish off these metal bastards. We're low on thermal clips, but I'm a biotic. Just give me cool. you want me to hit him with the good stuff. All right. Power wheel. Levitate. Overload, combat drone, gas shield boost. Target down. No, they want me to use a specific power. Just give the order and I'll hit him with a biotic power. I thought that's what I did. Okay, let's try this again here. That's it. Ah. Yay! Ready to get the hell off this go, station. Go, go, power wheels! And kill everything. Yeah, let's get out of here. Way to those shuttles. Depends I'm on the shimmery! It's probably best if we check. No. Wilson, this is Jacob. I'm here with Commander Shepard. 
Just took out a wave of mechs over in D-Wing. Shepard's alive? How the hell? Basically. Never mind. You need to get her out of there. Get to the service tunnels and head for the network control room. Cool. Roger that, Wilson. Stay on this frequency. I'm not gonna ask question. Let's, Let's just go. Here. You bet. We can get into the service tunnels through this door. Cool. Onward. Yeah, I always found it interesting that this has two companions and Dragon Age has three. Shepard's alive. Take her to the nearest sewers. They're service tunnels, not sewers. Ow! This sucks. Wilson, find us another route out of here. Preferably one that doesn't lead straight in. Oh, God. They found me. Help. Wilson, oh, quit whining. You? Everybody's dying. It's not just you. Up. Jacob, you can talk about it, or we can go do something about it. Down here. Hi. Bastards got me in the leg. Hey, I remember you. you. Were there the first time I regained consciousness. Yeah, that was me. <laughs> How about we talk about this after we fix my leg? Should be some meta gel in the Weiner. first aid station on the wall. Hopefully, there's enough to get him up and moving again. Grab the meta gel from the first aid station on the wall. Ah, uh, meta gel. The slap some goo on it and you'll be fine. School of uh, video games. Uh, select Unity. Use power. Ooh, the leg. Poor Thanks, baby. Shepherd. I'm bleeding to yeah, death. Like oh, wah. Wow. I guess that makes us even. I now. died in space. Thought maybe I could shut down the security mechs. But whoever did this fried the whole system. Completely irreversible. We didn't ask what you were doing. Why do you even have security mech clearance? Try and fix this. Besides, nice I was misdirect. Shot. How do you explain that? I don't trust any of you. You're all strangers to me. Let's get someplace safe and then we'll sort out whose fault it is. Right, Shepard. We need to find Miranda. We can't leave her behind. Forget about Miranda. She was over in D-Wing. The mechs were all over that sector. There's no way she survived. A bunch of mechs won't drop Miranda. She's alive. Then where is she? Because she's a badass. There are only two possible explanations. She's either dead, or she's a traitor. Eh, either way. Then why did she wake me up and warn me about the attack? Okay, maybe she's not a traitor. But that doesn't change the facts. We're here. She's not. So you're the traitor, which I know, Shuttle but Bay is only a few. Can overload the canisters to clear a path to the shuttles. It's next up. Oh, we must quit. That's it. Let's get Yay. out of here. Yeah, I could have done that okay, too. Okay, took him down. This is getting tense. Shepard, if I tell you who we work for, will you trust me? No. This really isn't the time, Jacob. We won't make it if she's expecting a shot in the back. If you want to piss off the boss, it's your ass, Jacob. The Lazarus Project. The program that rebuilt you. It's funded and controlled by Cerberus. Those assholes? I wiped out my share of Cerberus projects when I was a Spectre. Back then they were trying to kill me. Why the change of heart? Those answers are way above my pay grade. But basically, things change. The Alliance declared you dead. They gave up. Cerberus spent a fortune to bring you back. Look, yeah, I'd we so work for the too. Reapers now. Right Do you now trust us? I you that would have to be one more. hell of an enemy to make you pair Once up with the, the station, Reapers. I'll take it to the elusive man. He'll explain everything. I promise. Elusive man. Is he in charge of all this? Yeah, that's not his real name, of course. Nobody knows who he really is. It was a code Cigar name man? The used for him. Cancer Kinda man? Stuck. No, that's a different actor. 
I'll never work for Cerberus. I don't care what they did or what you say. I am not working with terrorists. You can tell it to the boss, but after we've saved our butts. Oh, don't be grumpy, Jacob. Ooh, I found some more Metagel and some credits. His mama didn't name him the elusive man. Yeah. There's always that kind of thing where if you actually knew the background of some of these people, it wouldn't be near as interesting. Die. Um. Okay. Running. Can I save yet? Nope. Okay. Getting to save point. Ooh, wait. Hehehe. <laughs> That was fun. It's okay, guys. I have a grenade launcher. Ooh, credits. Okay. Oh, great. It's Simon Says. I suck at this game. And there, and there, and there. Yay! I have some money. Test subject has been recovered, but the damage is far worse than we initially thought. Why aren't these all in one office? And internal injuries from the explosion. Subject has suffered significant cellular breakdown due to long term exposure to fat hey. zero temperatures. Despite the extent Wasn't that bad, trauma, was it? Cool. Alright, onward. Oh cool, I can save. Okay, um, so I actually got to a save point. I'm going to go ahead and call this the end of this video. I will see you on Monday for more Bow Chicka Chicken Police. And you have a good one too, less terrible. See ya!